Sister Girl Tuesday, back at it again with another video. And today I'm joined by a very special guest. Can you sound more excited? <laughs> My name is Matthew. How y'all doing? <laughs> All right, so today we're doing something a little bit different. We are doing a restaurant review. So if you are in the greater San Diego area and you're looking for a brunch spot, we are going to be reviewing Swampies. So if you want to see what we thought, get our candid thoughts and um, opinions, thoughts and opinions, yeah, uh, and see what we ordered, just keep watching this video, but you already know before you go, don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe, and I'll see y'all next time. Good array of uh, condiments here, you know what I'm saying? Got the young tapatio, a little chalula in the situation. Um, is that supposed to be? I don't know. Syrup? Is syrup? Okay. That's different. Got a little A1, keeping it A1, you feel me? Don't nobody mess with Tabasco for real, for real. And uh, some sugar free. Okay. And then obviously your salt and pepper. Oh, I missed this one. That looks like something from Alabama. And uh, some jellies. We're recording, we live. All right, tell the people what you got. Okay, so I got the Belgian waffle with strawberry. I requested, special request, from the chef. Kyle Five. Um, so hard. What'd you put on them? What'd you put on them? What'd you put on them? Cholula. That's the only, Cholula is the only hot sauce that you put on breakfast foods. Okay. If you're using anything else, you're just doing it wrong. Okay. Chicken sausage. Chicken sausage. Because they didn't have turkey. Okay, I'm going to give you a second to like cut your food up so that way you don't have to struggle on camera. Okay. Tell us about the eggs and sausage. The eggs and the sausage were splendid. Oh. <laughs> the okay. sausage. Alright, like, I'm gonna let you chew and then I'm gonna come back. Line, a hot link, but it was really good. I like hot links anyways. So that, was, <laughs> that was fine with me. The eggs had the perfect <laughs> amount of cheese. And then as I said before, Okay. Okay, so I'm gonna um, try my foods and um, let me try some potatoes first. We're putting some condiments uh, right here on the potatoes. Okay. Okay. okay, plate update. So my sandwich in the description, like it gives you the option to ask for real bacon or mock bacon. And like I wasn't prompted at the register and I forgot to say mock bacon. So I was really excited to take that first bite, but I couldn't because I don't need bacon. So I am gonna try this chips and salsa. Okay, they get points for cute chips. All right, here we go. Mmm, I love warm chips and I love fresh dip. All right guys, food update. So my sandwich also originally came with alfalfa and that's the one thing in the world that I'm allergic to. And they remade my food, they put the veggie bacon in it, but they left the alfalfa on. But, it's gonna be a little crazy girl, you know, she, she be working in the medical field and whatnot. I keep some Benadryl on me, so I'm gonna scrape off as much as I can and pray that the Benadryl helps me to not die. This isn't gonna be cute, but it's gonna be real, so sandwich with nothing on it. Here we So we are post breakfast um, brunch. You're so right. It's definitely after Um Currently, I'm not having a reaction, but we'll give it. We'll give it time. How did you feel about your food? My food is good. It's, as I said, perfect amount of cheese, um, chicken sausage, salad, tuna, or, or die. Um, don't die. Kind of way to just um, Strawberries were really good. They were really good. They were really good. They were like sugar sweet, but not like I didn't syrup. offer her a strawberry. She took I definitely took it. She took it. This is true. Um, cream was good. Got it. How was the water? The water, the, water the water was wet. <laughs> Believe it or not, the water was also good. Okay, so good. 
Um, you already know the drama that happened with my sandwich, but like I said, no reaction at present. Potato seed. We could use a heavy more seasoning, but you know, maybe I just I like salt for more flavor. Anyway, um, the croissant that my sandwich was on was like buttered to perfection and like nice and like just the whatever sauce they put on it like didn't saturate the bread so it wasn't like mushy. I thought that was really good. Um, however, when it came to my chips and salsa, the chips were warm. I love warm chips. Uh, they were, I don't even know if they were salty, but I'm okay with that. It's just that the amount of salsa they gave me was not enough. It was like children's size salsa. Like. But I'm really pleased overall with this place. If you had to rate it on the scale of zero to ten, zero, not good. Ten, the best you've ever had. Where is Swamp? You give your rating and I'll give mine too. But hurry up, it's not on so. As it makes me wait. Okay, now let's go. Seven? Seven. Today. Today I get an eight or a nine. Today. I'll go with that too. Um, seven, seven and a half, you know, because they were pretty, pretty chill about taking my plate back to redo it, so it was cool. Oh, the one thing we did not really like is that when you first enter, based on the setup of the restaurant, like there's no directions, and if it's your first time here, like you're kind of confused on like, what do you do? Because you don't, there's no hostess to like seat you. And you order first to get your number and then you sit down. But the wait wasn't bad, especially for a weekend brunch, yeah, you know? Kind of packed and it's a holiday, so yeah. pretty great. Alright, um, anything else you want to say to the folks? Okay, well you already know, before you go, don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe, and I'll see y'all next time.